Hey, Screaming Geek Media here. I am Jerry the Geek. Uh, today I'm back with another 4K review, and we're going to talk about Dread on 4K. Uh, but before we do, if you like physical media on 4Ks, Blu-rays, even DVDs, home theater, movies, Xbox, you know, if you like any of that stuff, check, you know, check out my other videos on my channel. Like I do discussions, reviews, custom covers, uh, collection updates. You know, check all that out. Like, subscribe, and turn your bell notifications on. Now today we're going to talk about Dread on 4K. You know, the movie is uh, came out in 2012. You know, it has our rating, uh, has uh, Carl Urban, uh, Olivia Thirlby, uh, Lena Headey, and uh, Wood Harris. I always remember him from Remember the Titans. Really good movie. Uh, directed by Pete Travis. The movie's uh, based on a, the comic book Judge Dredd, which, you know, they did a movie back in, I think, 1995 with uh, Sylvester Stallone, which for some weird reason, I don't remember watching it. You know, as big of a Stallone fan I am, for some reason I never never got around to seeing it. But here they did a remake of it, and it's very well done. You know, it has a violent society where the police force has the ability, you know, they've got the power to be judge, jury, and executioner on on crimes. And they're actually called, uh, they actually call them judges. So the main character, his name is Dread. So, you know, called Judge Dread. He basically gets a new partner, a trainee, that she is a psychic, has a built that ability, works with her, and they go to this uh, place and actually get stuck in this building, they get trapped, and everybody's out to kill them. And it is a very violent movie. It's a lot of fun. It's got a dark, you know, style to it. It's very gritty looking. And the drugs that are involved, they call it slow mo to where when you take it, you feel like you know, everything's going in slow motion. So there's scenes scattered in the movie that are just have that everything's just slow motion. They have some vibrant colors. So very well done movie. I don't think it was well received. I wish I would have, you know, I would have loved to have seen more made. I think it had a potential there. So this 4K comes from a Lionsgate. Came out in 2017, but the steel book I have here came out in 2021. It's a Best Buy exclusive. Um, both versions have the Blu-ray 3D. You know, the movie was com uh, completely filmed in digital, so it has a 2K digital intermediate and an HDR10, so everything's upscaled to 4K. As it's filmed in digital, you'd expect it to be, you know, flawless, and it pretty much is. It's very impressive. You know, a lot of details, the textures, uh, Dredd's facial stubble, you know, I mean, really pops. And the details on the uniforms, and the, you know, deep, rich blacks. And then there's some colors that, colors really pop at times, especially during the slow-mo sequences. So very impressive here. Now, as far as comparing the Blu-ray and the 4K, not a whole lot. Sl slight color timing, you know, maybe... You know, the between warmer and cooler tones, but not a lot. The Blu ray is pretty impressive in itself. So, here, check out a few screenshots of the Blu ray and the 4K. Then we'll come back and talk about the audio packaging and the bonus features. We'll see you in a couple minutes.
So for the audio, they gave us a Dolby Atmos track here. And man, I don't, I don't have Dolby Atmos, so I'm just listening to 5.0. But damn, this thing freaking rocks. All, you know, all the gunfire, everything that's going on, great use of surround, you know, channel separation. Everything just so well balanced. And then you throw in a low, uh, the deep low bass. And even the music, you know, the score was done by uh, Paul Leonard uh, Morgan. Wonderful score here as well. So this is definitely a kick-ass audio track. You definitely want to crank this up and just it'll blow you away. Now for the package, again, I got, I got the steel book here that, that came from Best Buy. You know, Lionsgate does a great job with their steel books and slip covers. You know, normally I throw these away, but this, this is definitely nice. I'll definitely hang on to this. Awesome steel book. It's got the front. And you got the different artwork for the Blu-ray and 4K. Then I take the disc out and got the artwork behind. So for the bonus features, we have Mega City Masters, 35 Years of Judge Dread. Uh, Day of Chaos, the visual effects of Dread 3D. Uh, Dread featurette. Also got uh, Dread's Gear. The Third Dimension. Uh, Welcome to Peach Trees, which is the name of the uh, building, the community that he gets stuck in. Also, we have the Dread motion comic prequel and a theatrical trailer. Now, I'll wrap it up with a freaking awesome uh, release here from Lionsgate. You know, the movie, it's great. If you haven't seen it, definitely check it out. It's really good. And as far as the Blu-ray to 4K, visually, not a big difference. You know, just something that you, your blacks will probably be a little bit deeper. Everything might be a, just a little bit uptick in details. Uh, the big difference will be the uh, audio. The Blu-ray has a DTS HD 7.1, where this has a Dolby Atmos. And the other thing is the cost. The Blu-rays are much cheaper. Uh, the 4K, the standard here is running $17.99. The steel book that I've got, uh, you can get on eBay for $34 on up. I got mine at the actually Best Buy store a few months ago for, I think, less than $20. So it's pretty cool. I didn't, you know, just come across it and picked it up. But I would recommend, you know, picking this up for your collection. Get, you know, get the 4K to get the better audio because it's going to knock your socks off. Definitely highly recommend picking this up. So that pretty much does it for my look at the 4K edition of uh, Dread. Uh, please check out my other videos on my channel. Like, subscribe, turn your bell notifications on, uh, comment below, let me know what you think, and we'll see you soon. Geek out!